Hi, this is Aarti Nadrajan from PG and Research Department of Computer Science, Idea College for Women, Kumbahonam. I hope that everyone is well and good and you people will get back from the lockdown too. This quarantine was changed everything in our life, especially our economic status. At the same time, there has been a great change in the field of education. We are compelled to accept this change in the field of education despite of lack of mass. It is not possible for the student to attend the classes at this time, which could result in loss of their studies. To avoid that, nowadays we are handling online classes. I know you might learn lot of technologies and app during this quarantine, but still this video to help you to learn new technology to handle the online classes. The race of Google, the race of Facebook, the race of Apple, I think there is a place for computer science as something that solve problem that the people face every day. The NAC proposed that every accredited institution establish an internal quality assurance cell as a post accreditation quality sustenance measure. The IQSC will become a part of an institution system and work towards realizing the goal of quality enhancement and sustenance. The IQSC will channelize the effort and measure of the institution toward academic excellence. A lot of programs on behalf of IQSC so far have been conducted to improve them for students and professors. During this lockdown, IQSC also hosted an awareness program on COVID-19, an online quiz, a two-day webinar, a five-day international conference and a workshop for the professor also. We will see in detail about Google Lens explained in that workshop. Google Lens is an artificial powered technology that comes in the year of 2017. Nowadays, artificial intelligence and machine learning used more or less in every application. Let us see how Google has used this technology in Google Lens. The Google Lens technology relies upon your smartphone camera to see what around you and give you contextual information about your surroundings. Using your camera on the handset, Google Lens can scan a product, animal, text or something else in the environment that and tell you what the object is. There are lot of functionality is associated with this particular application. So let have a look at those functionality and how good are they. Before going to the session, we first install Google Lens app. To do that, select Play Store app. In the search bar, type Google Lens. Now, you will get the app link. I already installed the app so that it show me a open button. For you and all, it show install button. You just click the install button and install the app properly. Let us begin with the first feature. Copy text from the real world is one of the feature which I used more. It gives the ability to take copy the content directly. It is a very interesting feature, right? To do that, just point the camera to the text very own copy from the head into the Google Lens more. Tap on the text which you want to copy which the Google Lens highlighted it. Now you can select the text and copy it on the copy text button. After copying that, we may paste the content wherever we need. It is an unbelievable one to see how Google Lens help you to getting information whatever the camera is being pointed out. The Google Lens uses the mobile camera to figure out the object and it show you the information. When you point your camera on the object, it show the details about the product and also display the same or similar object as well as the website where you can find. Even you can upload an image from the gallery which you are not aware of it. Let's see an example. Now 
I am going to take a pic of a mobile phone. Let us see what will happen. Yes, after clicking this, it show me what type of mobile it is and also it show the relevant images along with the link. You may click any one of these link and let me know the full detail of mobile phone. This is how searching icon works in Google Lens. I already told that we may get image from the gallery, right? Let us see. I am going to choose this image. See what result we will receive. Dell VM126 is the name of the product. So, this is one way of knowing the product, what it is. The next feature is scanning and translating. Translating the text is the wonderful feature offered by the Google Lens. You can easily translate the word which you see on any surface to your deciding language. For example, if you are seeing the text in English, we can translate it into Tamil, French, Arabic, whatever the language which you need. Let us see an example for translation. Before that, I would like to show the content which I want to translate. This is the content which I am going to translate into other language. To do that, first select the translation button. After that, selecting the content which we want to translate. See how it is converted? We may choose any language which we want instead of Tamil. I am selecting Arabic. See, now the text is translated into Arabic. This is how the translation feature is working in Google Lens. The next feature is shopping and style match. It is definitely a pretty feature to have on your mobile phone. If you find a cool handbag, dress, mobile, gadgets, whatever you want, do the same as you did for searching. Google Lens will help you to find the right or similar one along with many links and reviews. Let us see an example for shopping. To do that, first select the shopping icon. After selecting that, we may choose the image. See, it saw the similar product which I am looking for. Let us see and one more example. Now I am selecting a laptop image. See, it show the product detail. If you need more, just click more result. See, it come up with various model, price and where it is available. If you need more detail about particular product, just click any one of the link and let us know the full detail of the product. Thank you all for patiently watching my video.